about how to find a BAPI based on a particular transaction code. Suppose you know the transaction code and you want to see the BAPI behind it. So any BAPI associated it with it, you can easily find it out. So the easiest way is you go to slash and suppose FB03, I want to see the BAPI for, for invoices. So I just enter here and then I'll go, is I click system status, okay? And generally this rule really works, but sometimes it may fail. Uh, let's see whether it works because sometimes it, we will be drilling down the BAPI uh, from a particular, you know, uh, from based on the function group. So here we will go to go to, we'll click attributes, okay? And here if you see, this is the package. Now we are going to get to a particular transaction code like, we are doing SE84, okay. So here, once we go to SE84, here you click on program library, okay. And here you put function modules, okay. And here you put the package and you execute, okay. Here you get everything. Now what you can do here, you can just search on BAPI and you execute. And here are all the BAPIs associated with this particular function group. So this was only for invoices. Now what we can do is we can try to search for suppose purchase orders, okay? So we could do the same ME23N. We, their system status. And from system status, you can always see the transaction code, the program and the user ID with which you are logged in. Okay, now if you double click on this and now you click on go to. So the moment that you, the program comes, we'll go to attributes. And here you see this is the package. So again, then what we are going to do, I'll do it from scratch. We'll go to slash and this is 84. Okay, and here we go to program. We go to function modules and here we put the function group and here we put mapping stuff and we find f8 we don't find anything so because here sometimes it may misfire because you have function group me where oh sorry i put the wrong thing it should not be here should be here so the package and here you can execute and you can see all the batteries here but sometimes it may not work because if the package SAP for some reason didn't create with the same package the BAPI with which what was in the transaction code it will it will not show but here if you see there is a bunch of BAPIs you have so let me just do one thing take this thing out just care about all the batteries and here you can see all the batteries that you can think of which is very useful and essential okay so in this way you know how how to find a particular a BAPI <coughs> that sap has given for free in the standard and for a particular transaction code very easy go to the transaction code go to the program get the package copy the package, go to SE84, go to function model, put the package name there and search with BAPI star and that's it. You get your get your uh, million dollar uh, BAPI, which you can use for your uh, updates for standard transaction codes.